This is a case of a laparoscopic abdominal rescue and circulage that was done in a patient. She was a case of IVF conception, DCD8 wing gestation, who already presented with cervical funneling with a McDonald's stitch in C2. She was taken up for a rescue circulage because she still had a, a residual cervical length of around 1.3 cm. Uh, this surgery is being performed by Dr. B. Ramesh. As we can see, first, the UV fold is created using harmonic and the bladder is pushed down. The patient was 17 weeks period of gestation, but since it was a DCD at wing gestation, the uterus was around 24 to 26 weeks. Throughout the procedure, the intra-abdominal pressure was maintained at 12 to 14 mm of Hg. Careful dissection of the uterovesical fold of peritoneum is done. A window is created in the broad ligament bilaterally after identifying the uterine arteries. This window is being created through the anterior approach. This is on the left side. The same procedure is repeated on the right side. Here we can see that the window and the broad ligament is created. Similar procedure repeated on the right side. A marceline tape 13 to 8 centimeter with needle is introduced. This is pushed into the space created anterior to posterior at the level of the internal os. Small bite of cervical tissue medial to the uterine artery at the level of the internal os is taken. On the right side, the tape is pulled forward posterior to anterior and again a bite of tissue is taken medial to the uterine artery at the level of the internal os and then the tape is tied anteriorly. Six knots are tied anteriorly. Adequate hemostasis is ensured and post-procedure through transvaginal sonography, the placement of the stitch is confirmed and fetal viability checked.